that dumbass uh, WWE. Yeah. yeah, I'm playing. I like whooping motherfuckers' asses in it, man. Like I was saying, yo, I don't even know who the fuck in WWE no more. These pink tight wearing motherfuckers. Like, they be wearing patent leather pink tights nowadays, flying off the ropes with goofy-ass hair, with ribbons tied around their elbows and shit. Like, I, like, I don't know these goofy-ass wrestlers. I'm from the days of Stone Cold, The Undertaker, Kane, Triple H, you feel me? All that. Like, I don't know these motherfuckers. Like... These weird ass dudes. Like yeah. I started watching it when the Miz and Dolph Ziggler, Kofi Kingston ass niggas start coming in. Like Kofi Kingston was actually cool. He bought the only black wrestler I like. I told you I don't like black wrestlers. That's some racist shit to say. And yeah, it, bro, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Fuck black wrestlers. Cause I, I so feel like, like <laughs> I'm about to say some real. I feel like white wrestlers are like the superior wrestlers. They the best wrestlers. Like, <laughs> hey, that's racist, bro. I feel that's like the same shit they was telling them, bro. That's racist, bro. <laughs> hey, yo, the white wrestlers was the best ones. Come on, you had Bret Hart, Shawn Michaels, Undertaker. Like, we ain't got no black wrestlers with no name like that. The black, I fucking D'Lo Brown. Like, bro. come on, get him the fuck out of here, D'Lo bro. Brown. You got, you got, you got, you got D'Lo Brown, bro. You got, you got the Rock, bro. Come on, bro. Man he, man, rock, man, 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 he Portuguese or something. Like he ain't all real. Nah, that nigga, that, hey, look, his daddy black. He black, bro. That sure. count. We got that one. That nigga was in the nation of domination, bro. Mark him, we bro. We got uh, Boogie. Man, come on, come his on. fat ass. His fat ass. He don't count. He he ain't like one of the best. <laughs> man. That nigga trash. His fat ass. He weigh, yo, he weighs seven hundred pounds. Like yo, <laughs> he's the, the world's strongest man, bro. Man, they, they know he ain't. Why they make? Why they give him that type? When was he ever the world's strongest man? You crazy, bro. Look it up. I think he won that shit like twice. Twenty years ago, or some shit. Thirty years ago. Hey, it don't matter. That's man, what he was no, he don't Nigga count like because when he had them braids, them braids was fake. So like, <laughs> he can't. No, nah, he can't be caught in the sea. He made us look bro. bad. He set his back for Hi, like. Bro. Come on, man. He the only wrestler to come he out. What the big mafia, show, bro? How you gonna hate on that, bro? He wasn't the big <laughs> show. He wasn't the big show. He but he came out the three six mafia, bro. What other rest of you know gonna do that, bro? Somebody gonna get the ass kicked. <laughs> <laughs> man, that song was the worst three six mile for your song ever in history. In history. Uh, look, uh, look, that was nothing but turn the club up. Just the WWF version, bro. Right, Mark all. Henry. Fat ass. That boy <laughs> man, he had horse legs, man. You was big as shit in that motherfucker. That little ass spandex. Oh, me. Jump man, look, black it wrestlers. Like sorry. Black wrestler, the only black wrestler I for real, for real, I fuck with Booker T. Come on, man, Scissor kicked the shit out you the back to. of your head. Yeah, you yeah, come on, he the yeah, only one. Dope. You a Booker T looking yeah, ass nigga yourself? You know. said Booker T, you want to bring your dreads out and shit? Look at this nigga, man. Booker T looking ass nigga. This nigga look like Booker T. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, man. You, you ball. You wish you could do it. You wish you could do it back in the day. Yeah, I look like that bum-ass nigga D-Lo Brown that can't wrestle. Bum-ass black wrestler. <laughs> Fat-ass nigga. He used to come up there. <laughs> Fat-ass nigga. He come up there with that wrong and shit. Yo, he trash. Like, black wrestlers was trash. Like, yo, I ain't saying no. I yo, love my black people. D-Lo Brown was not trash, bro. Yo, he was super trash. Yo, that man Kilo came out there in the man, that man came out there in the onesie with the boots already connected onto the onesie. That man, <laughs> that man came out there in the onesie, bro. Trash. You feel yeah, me? I my mind on Brown, bro. He was wrestling. Dope. He had some dope black wrestlers, bro. It's yeah. your mentality why we why they wasn't promoted in the mainstream. But they was whack. They was whack. Hey, like yo, black bro. men, black men don't deserve in the and don't deserve to be in the wrestling ring, man. They don't. They should. I ain't gonna say no. don't deserve to be. They shouldn't be in the wrestling ring. Wrestling is a white man sport. <laughs> wrestling man, is a, no, I, look, <laughs> it's a white man out, sport. I can't agree with. Booker T, the only one, man. Booker T. 
Fucking D-Lo Brown. What's another whack black wrestler, man? All them niggas. Look at that. Look, 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 look at the Dudley Brothers. Look, look at the, the Dudley Brothers. Bro, the Rock was up there. Okay. The Rock is arguably the, the second greatest wrestler out of the WWF, bro. Who the first? Stone Cold. Maybe so. Or The Undertaker. Come on now. Stop playing. Stop nah, playing. bro. Ain't The Undertaker. Nah. Dude. Over Stone Cold? Nah. Yeah, possibly, yeah. Possibly. Nah, see, you only said that because you older than me, so you don't grew up longer with the Undertaker. <laughs> yeah, so uh, you got to understand, yeah. That old it's ass different. Thing, nah, bro. Yeah. Nah, bro. Stone Cold give you that energy when he come out, bro. And as soon as you hear that motherfucking glass shatter, the niggas just screaming, bro. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you already know. Yeah, after you know somebody's gonna get their ass whooped, bro. But still, hold up. When them <laughs> lights go out and you hear that doom, come on, man. When that stone, when that Undertaker music come hey, on, you already know what it is, yo. It's like, yo, you could possibly die. Like, you know when that music come on, you could hey, possibly, hey. like, somebody could die. Like, you could die tonight. Like, come on, that's the Undertaker. Come on, man. Die <laughs> fucking boredom. That entrance was, like, ten minutes long. That nigga walking slow as fuck down there with this Damien music. <laughs> 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 yeah. Come hey yo, on. but wrestling bro, yo. Don't get me wrong. He dope. But though nah, I I take points off of when he started doing the American badass shit coming down there with the motorcycle. With the bandana and shit like that. He got real corny. <laughs> he got real corny. He got real fucking corny. Hey, wrestling got real fucking corny, like just like how I wanted to talk about how this music nowadays then got real fucking corny. Ain't a whole lot of rapping going on. And a lot of rap today is bullshit. I'ma go ahead and say it. It's a whole lot of bullshit going on. Just like this dumbass wrestling, how I said how the names changed. Listen, let's go back to the wrestling. Listen to the names in wrestling. Stone Cold. Triple H. The Rock, <laughs> Kane, Undertaker, and then you got these new motherfuckers, Dolph Ziggler, The Miz, what's another weird ass motherfucker, uh, CM Punk, well he, he, he was, he was, he was like the last when I stopped CM watching, Punk was corny. huh? CM Punk was corny bro, that dude couldn't wrestle bro, that nigga was shit. corny bro. Like, it was CM Punk. What's another corny motherfucker when they start coming in? When they start getting real corny, start getting John real weird. Cena, that nigga was corny. That was the, that, that, that's what killed him. When John Cena came in with that ruthless aggression shit, that's what killed me. I'm like, nah. Nah, bro. Hey, nah, yo, I, I, man, fuck, man, fuck John Cena. He come in here trying to try, act like a thug and shit. Nigga from West Newbury, Massachusetts. I remember when he first came out, he was talking about thugonomics. Hey. Then he switched up to the military shit. Then he got away from, like, the hip-hop shit. <laughs> like, boy, he was never hip-hop. Fuck out of here. Thugonomics. That's when hip-hop started getting real dangerous. He said, nah, let me get my shit. Let me get on up out of here. Let me, let me. <laughs> nigga said, nigga said, word life. This is real life thugonomics. I say, yo, fuck John Cena. Yeah, thugonomics. Hey, yo, arguably. Hey, yo, no, hold on. Get back. Let's heard, get back bro. to these black wrestlers. I got one more black, one more fucked up bum ass black wrestler for you. That nigga R Truth. Get him the fuck out of here, R Truth. You bro, remember R Truth? No, bro. That dude is considered a legend. Nah, he ain't no legend. bro. He, he a bum. Bro, he been. Yo, yeah, he been bro. wrestling for forever, bro. Nah, hey, yo, just like you been wrestling that, so long, don't mean you was good. Don't mean you was good because you yo, wrestling for 20 nigga. years. Yo, bro, nah, bro. I ain't giving you that one. You just racist, bro. <laughs> hey, yo, R-Truth was whack. He a bum-ass wrestler, yo. Black dude. He, how was he whack, bro? Nah, he hey, yo, do you remember? <laughs> hey, yo, do you remember when he used to try to hit the flips in the ring? He used to try to do a backflip. <laughs> <laughs> he could never get that yo, shit right. He could never. That was like Booker T's brother, man. Come on, bro. No, that no, 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 no. <laughs> that ain't Booker T, bro. That ain't, ain't his little cousin. We ain't even gonna go there. They don't know each other. <laughs> Booker T beat the shit out of R Truth. They get the fuck out of here. What the fuck is R Truth? That was Booker T like, bro. Come on, that. No, he was nothing like Booker T. He came out there in some leather jeans. He he came out there in some leather jeans and some fucking, uh, some nursing shoes. And this nigga tried to wrestle with them fucking dreadlocks that couldn't quite <laughs> lock right. His dreads, them locks ain't never locked. Yo, his locked haven't locked. I, I always wanted, 
I always wondered if that was a personal choice or yeah, it just never locked. It, it should never lock. He came out there with a dress shirt, man. He used to come out there in the blouse. He used to come out there in the blouse with seashells around his neck. Like, come on, man. Like, he's making black people look bad. Get out the wrestling ring. Niggas don't belong in the wrestling ring. Crazy, <laughs> right, man. No attention to you, bro. 